Can Aaron Rodgers and the Green Bay Packers get it together? Or is Aaron Rodgers done? Let's talk about it right now. But it's like he's trying to run a one-man band out there. He's trying his seat. And he's coming. This is a make or break season for He's got to make an impact. Hey guys, welcome back to the show. If it's your first time watching, hit the like button and subscribe. It's right here on the screen for you to hit that button, click and subscribe. But let's dial in to Aaron Rodgers, the topic and conversation of the day because this guy's the man. He's the legend in Green Bay. The Packers love him, but when do you turn the page? Look, before we get started, I love Aaron Rodgers. I think the guy's the man. I love Aaron Rodgers. But listen, there comes a point in time where the Green Bay Packers say, look, we got to turn the page. Are you going to draft a quarterback? Do you put the backup in just to get this guy Sim Jelen? I know Aaron Rodgers has a big contract. He's getting paid big money. But listen, you are the man until you're no longer the man. And right now, he's teeter-tottering at that. I think the fan base for the Packers, NFL fans in general, they got big hopes for him. But you got to win the big game. Got to get to the playoffs. You got to win the Super Bowl. And it doesn't look like that's going to happen. I got to bring something else up even bigger than that because – Outside of the fact that Aaron Rodgers looks uncomfortable, I mean, it looks like he's just getting a little older. I'm not trying to say he doesn't have it. He's slowing down. I'm not trying to say that because that just happens naturally. But what I am saying is he doesn't look comfortable out there for the Packers anymore. He doesn't look like that guy that used to be on the field, that warrior, that competitor. But the big question is, the minute Adams left the team, the minute that happened, Packers fans were shocked. I mean, the world was shocked. NFL fans, sports fans are shocked. And I got to tell you, Aaron Rodgers had to be shocked because at the end of the day, you lost your number one weapon. You're trying to get to the big game. You're trying to win the Super Bowl. That's what they want him there for. And then all of a sudden, Adams is walking out the door. Being that Aaron Rodgers is one of the best quarterbacks to play, one of the best of all time, a lot of people put him in a top 10, a top 15 category, wherever you want to put him is fine. But at the end of the day, if you're that talented, how do you let that receiver walk out the door. You got to meet with that organization. You got to meet with your team, your coaches, and the owner and say, look, I need this guy. You're paying me big money. You want me to win football games. You want these fans happy. We got to keep this guy in the locker room. That's gone now. So Aaron Rodgers has an uphill battle. He's got some weapons. I'm not saying he doesn't have a good running back in the backfield. I'm not saying he doesn't have a good receiver out there. His core is okay. But when you're losing games consecutively and the Packers fans And of course, the team organization, they want to win games. It's not happening. And I got big questions. I think the NFL has big questions. What's going on Aaron Rodgers? Does he want to stay? Is he done? Does he want to move on to the next chapter? Does he want to get in the media? Does he want to start doing commentating? I think think he has a lot to offer. Aaron Rodgers has a lot to offer people in football, especially in sports. But it doesn't look like the Packers are going to do any better with Aaron Rodgers. I think the next topic and the next at hand is you got to start looking at the draft picks. Who do you got coming out of these big teams and these top 10? Who do you have? What quarterback is leading in college football that the Packers can turn to? I think that's the next question. And I'm not saying that Aaron Rodgers has done this season. I'm just saying he's on his way out. The Aaron Rodgers era is over. You know, unless he wants to pull Brett Favre and end up going, you get traded to play for the Jazz, you play somewhere else. That's the next option. At the end of the day, They need to get a quarterback into that locker room that can mold, maybe learn a little bit from Aaron Rodgers. They can mold him a little bit. Maybe it's a draft pick. There's a lot of players coming up. Get a guy in the locker room. Let Aaron Rodgers help out and get them some credit because, listen, the Packers fans are getting salty and they want to win. And it looks like this season, NFL 2022, the Packers are not going to turn out that well. If you ask me, Aaron Rodgers is done again. I love Aaron Rodgers. But I think this guy's end is coming soon. Hey, guys, thanks for watching and tuning into the Brandon Mason Show. Please remember to like and subscribe. Until next time.